we decided that there was a real call to have one of the classic lyric arts programs here in the United States. And as we were expanding, of course, the, the first question is, what is it going to be? What is the focus here? How do we differentiate that from the French and the Italian programs? And as we were thinking, brainstorming about what is the repertoire that really is central to everybody's career path, we decided that to focus one program entirely on the music of Mozart was going to make perfect sense. The music of Mozart is demanding on so many levels. It's demanding as far as using the language. Of course, it's demanding as far as understanding classical style. And the most challenging part of it is the recitative, which is the semi-spoken, semi-sung part that really uh, moves the action forward and requires really the greatest amount of artistry because it requires a lot of improvisation in terms of understanding how to shape language. Very good, now it's the machina. Okay, now it's a question. So it is very important that the singers, the young students, understand what they are singing in order to express the feelings that the words imply. So I always tell them, if, uh, if you don't feel what you are singing, you cannot convey anything to the audience because you are not feeling anything. So that's, that's no easy. The overwhelming amount of encouragement and support, um, hyping each other up, seeing people make breakthroughs or small growths in just the frame of two weeks is really wonderful. And I think CLA meets you where you are and it's like a retreat. You get to come somewhere and really just delve into this music in such a focused and supportive and kind environment. I'm so grateful for that. It's very important for a young singer to get the opportunity to take time away from everything else that dominates their lives and completely immerse themselves in a specific professional environment and build a connection with the work on a deep level. It's too much. And to do this in a circle of colleagues and other students so you can grow with each other, that's very, very unique. CLA has this magical blend of craft and play. So the level of expertise that the faculty bring, the, the quality that we're expected to develop is extremely high. But then there's this welcoming sense of adventure and exploration that really I think is what makes it possible. So once you've experienced it, it's a little bit addictive and you just wanna keep coming back. Approaching singing and technique in a way that is nuanced but intentional in an environment that lets you do so has been really special. So I'd say that's probably my favorite part of this program. Walking to the frog pond, relaxing myself, and then walking to a coaching. <laughs> My first objective is to really show the young singers what the professional world is like. And so to give them a glimpse of what the expectations are, what the standards are, and how to get there. There's words that can mean anything, you know. You, it can be Susanna, it can be Susanna, you know, it can be anything. In the professional world, you have to arrive prepared on day one. Everybody's on their own journey here. And it's a beautiful thing because we're all on our own journeys together. And we are able to then form bonds with each other. We're able to connect with each other. We're able to connect to this music and to this incredible thing that is opera, that is singing, that's expressing ourselves through music. And we try to set the stage as it were so that we can really focus on this thing that we all love.
it is inexorably connected. Mm -hmm. the, the, the diaphragm, the abs, and your neck and, and throat muscles. For art to take its full potential impact as a force of good for our world, one that instills empathy and connection and community, we need to have that sense of openness and we need to have happy artists who feel inspired and feel empowered and feel like they have the agency to create in the ways that they want to. And I believe that CLA is doing that work for young artists and for emerging artists. When anyone says, I am going to make a life in music, that means that they are successful already. There is a place for them. The fact is that what everybody in this field will do is to bring more music into this world, and I can't imagine anything more important. Thank you.